I got a care package for, sorry for bumping the camera, or more like a, my mom <clears throat> is cleaning out her house in the hopes that someday she's moving into a condo. Um, so this is what I got, and I thought I would open it with you, because it's an unboxing, but it's not like a, a cool kind of unboxing. And I'm pretty sure that there's candy in here. So, whoa. All right. So the first thing I got my sister's Mary Kay distributor. I don't think she has a website or I would link to her Mary Kay website. But she sent me a travel thing for makeup. So it has a number of diff different clear pouches and then it has a hanger. So this is nicer than the one I have. I think it'll hold a lot more product. Um, I have one that I got to go to the gym. No, look, I can't figure out how it goes back together. This is this is too complicated for someone, you know, like me. So I guess it folds up like that. So it's not as small, but you know, it'd be good for a suitcase. Then I've got Donald Driver from the newspaper February 7th 2013 then I got some stationary printer paper that I left at my parents house a long long time ago and more stationary that again I left at my parents house a long time ago so there's a couple of these cards and then I had stamped the envelopes. I think uh, my roommate got all my stamps and ink pads when I moved. Not, you know, by my choice, but apparently that was one of the things I didn't have time to move before I left. And, oh, this is from, I think this is from Japan. And I don't know if there's any rose petals still in here, but it was like stationary. Um, it says fragrance of nature. It still smells like roses, even though like I used the petals up long ago. Um, then I got my old baseball glove, which is in serious need of some like linseed oil. And uh, you know, probably don't have the my baseball anymore. This seems like kind of small on the small side. I don't think my hands grew since I was 14. But. Anyway, now I can uh, play catch with myself. Alright, I got a bunch of National Geographic maps. This is 1863. This must be like Civil War. Yeah, turning point of the Civil War. Then I got the Gulf of Mexico, Layers of Life. The Great Rift Valley, Mono Key, the world's tallest mountain, so that's Hawaii, and Great Migrations. I don't know. If you want any of these National Geographic uh, map things, you can comment below. And, I was right, there's candy, my favorite, Saltwater Taffy from Picket Slave. And Cadbury cream eggs, which probably have GMOs in them, but they're almost irresistible. I resisted this year. And lime green peeps. Bet this better than your pop box was. Alright, then maybe my sister's deciding she's not doing Mary Kay anymore, or maybe these are like extras or last season set hands never goes out you know so this is a satin hands 
Satin Smoothie Hand Scrub, Satin Hands Hand Cream, and then there's a sample of Extra Emollient Night Cream. And then there's a bunch of sample packets. A bunch of sample packets. So I don't know if these are last seasons and they're discontinued or she's just like, I'm not going to use these anymore. So I got a bunch of sample packets for the berries, like a ton of them. And that includes the Mineral Eye Colors Honey Spice, Chocolate Kiss, and Navy Blue, and the Mineral Cheek Color Golden Copper, and the Lipstick Berry Kiss. So I don't know how many are in each of these. So I got uh, three samples of the berries. Here's another satin hand sample. Then I got a sample of the tawny. Tawnies. And it has sweet cream, eyeshadow, sienna eyeshadow, and granite. And then the blush color is Shy Blush, and the lip color looks kind of crazy. Um, it's called Sweet Nectar. So I got uh, three of those, and um, four of the satin hand samples all together. So just to, you know. Take care of my curiosity here. There are one, two, three, four, five Mary Kay samples in each of these packets. So I have three of the tawny and three of the berry. Um, if you would like a Mary Kay sample, comment below because that's like 15 samples wearing like the same color makeup. That's whoa, can I do that? Alright, so I got a CD holder case and it has a uh, MM, whatever album that was, I don't remember what it was called. I got one that says Workout CD, 27th of February 2007. Random Mix Audio CD. So, just so you know, all these mixed CDs, you know, I, they're my own music, right? Yeah. So, there's some more, uh, mixed CDs in there. Then, there's this old purse from, uh, 2003, maybe? It's faux leather with butterflies, and I got it at Walmart, um... I specifically got it because I had a date and I was like, I don't have any appropriate handbags. Um, apparently, the zipper is kind of missing a tooth on there. But it opens up and then it has like another little pocket on the inside. And it has a snap pocket. And then in the back, it has like a little pocket for your wallet. And it did come with a wallet originally, but... I used the wallet that came with it as my wallet, and it wore out after three or four years. And then my sister sent me a Mary Kay palette, which, um, I'm not sure. I think it's supposed to be, like, you're supposed to get a blush and two eyeshadows. Or maybe it's just blush or powder. I don't know what's supposed to go in there. And then lipstick. Oh, this is one of the magnetic palettes. Cool, because I have an eyeshadow that I ran out of room in my palette for. Um, and then I got a lip gloss, which I probably can't put on my lips because I already have lip gloss on my lips. So this one is Gold Rush. It's a very sheer, peachy, gold color. And Sweet Nectar. Oh, this is a lipstick. Which looks like it matches with the um, 
lip gloss. This is also pretty sheer. Whoa. You can see it's a darker pink one there. And the shimmery one on top is the gloss. So those are good summers for color. Colors for summer. So then your lipstick goes in here and close it and then it doesn't fall out. Um and then I got oh of the 2012, it looks like, uh, National Geographics, which is why this costs so much to ship. Yeah, all the 2012 National Geographics. So I'm sure I will get, be getting um, more packages sometime in the distant future. Um, so if you would like some Mary Kay samples for the tawnies or the berries, or you are interested in these National Geographic maps, uh, comment below. I know not that many people watch my videos. You know, I only have I'm up to seven subscribers now. Woohoo! Thank you guys! Yay! Um, <laughs> but. I, I've been thinking about the Deva Curl stuff I got, the samples, you know, the, like, deluxe size samples. And I'm going, you know, I don't know what I was thinking. I was thinking it was like some sort of, I didn't research it first. And I was thinking it was some kind of curl enhancing lotion, you know, that you put on your hair. I think it's meant for people that have naturally curly hair or that have perms. And I don't think that people do perms anymore. That was like in the 90s. Um, or 70s. People don't do that now. Um, but if you have curly hair, I'm thinking about doing a giveaway for the Deva Curl stuff. So, um, comment below if you want the Deva Curl samples. And I will consider shipping them out to you. And I'm also going to have a ton of extra seeds, like, um, I've been collecting red salad bowl lettuce seeds, and way more than I possibly could plant. I already probably have enough that if I wanted to plant all of my raised beds in fall with, uh, red salad bowl lettuce, I would have enough seeds to do that. Um, if I collect all of them, I'm going to have enough seeds to broadcast all over the yard and just see if any of it grows anywhere else besides the raised beds. Um, and I have a ton of cantaloupe, honeydew, swan lake melon, um, what else do I still have a ton of? That's probably it. Like, um, oh, butternut squash I have still quite a few left of. Blue banana squash, which probably, depending on where you live, won't grow where you live because it needs it to be really hot, um, and has a pretty long growing season. So... But anyways, yeah. Share the love, man! So, Mary Kay samples, National Geographic maps, uh, seeds, and, uh, yeah. I don't know. Comment below if you want some stuff. Alright, peace out.